Hello, Viking Clan friends. Uh, this is Tim the Poet. I play Viking Clan on MySpace and on Facebook, and I am just now uh, learning how to edit videos uh, a little bit better. So I'm taking some clips that I've haven't published yet. I haven't put them on the internet because uh, I was collecting the information and just didn't quite know how to put it all together yet. I'm using a screenshot capture program. Uh, the program I'm using is BSR and right now I'm currently using trial mode so I'm limited to 10 minutes. Uh, even though I can upload an hour or more on YouTube, I can only put these together in 10 minute parts and then I have to like paste them together so it's a hassle. So I'm looking for a better uh, free use uh, screen capture program. If anybody knows, uh, please message me. Uh, I've used a couple and I'll be making a video about screen capture programs uh, eventually. Right now I'm uh, at level 719. I'm about to turn, change over to level 720. I'm playing on MySpace or this game is fr this this game screen is from MySpace. But MySpace and Facebook, uh, the game is very similar. There's some minor differences in uh, accepting friends and a few things. Also, I am currently using Google Chrome. Uh, there are minor differences when you play uh, the same game, whether it's on MySpace or Fi Firefox. Okay, If you play MySpace with Google Chrome and you play MySpace with Facebook, there will be some minor differences in the way the game plays and the screen changes. So, but the basic thing is the basics are the same. Uh, I'll try to point out when I come across when I uh, come across things that are different. Right now, we're in the you win game. Okay, the you win screen. I just beat the guy down and I've won the battle. Now that doesn't mean that I've defeated him because it just means I've won the battle and I've run out of health. That puts me in what I call, my terminology is, my resting state. Okay, uh, it, this is up here is your health. And this, is, this here is, uh, a lot of people don't really understand what's going on with health. And it's pretty complicated. So I'm going to try to just briefly touch on this. That right now, my resting health, I have a health of uh, 1,116. My total maximum health is 8,500. I'm seeing a lot of people that are making the mistake of once they get to this point, they heal, and then they go and they go to sleep and they leave themselves up with 8,500 uh, health. And uh, somebody bigger is going to come along and just beat beat on you. Okay, you're going to lose. Uh, you're asking for trouble if you do it. What you need to do, if say somebody comes along, this, the, the, your danger here, depending on your level, okay, there's not that many people that can act slap a thousand at uh, level 720. There are a few maybe, but not that many. Uh, so right now, I'm fairly safe uh, from being, uh, because I don't, I don't even sh Show on the battle board. I don't think uh, when I'm in the hospital here. It's technically some people call it. Well, some people call it hiding. Okay, you're hiding in the hospital. You only show on the battle board when you're of, in full health. Now you'll also there's possibility you can show in the valid deal, but you can't be killed uh, from that screen. So right now the big thing I want to point out is uh, when you see this here, there's an option you can go down here before, and this will help your game out a lot. You scroll down and you see this here says show details all right send a message and show achievement progress the thing you want to really learn to, to check out is show details this will show uh, that right now here this shows that I used a 5% battle boost my uh, current attack strength is 747 his was 5 and it doesn't show his exact uh, health strength Okay, I only had 1,008 chieftains, but he had 1,181 chieftains. Okay, so this is a little deal to one guy who said, what about, why? what's the use of beating on people smaller? Well, I, I attack everybody that's on the battlefield, okay? This guy happened to be a little bigger than me, had more chieftains. Okay, so uh, I'll go into this uh, later about the 1,000 max chieftains and stuff. You're, uh, you can have... 
two, three thousand chieftains, but you can only use one thousand of your uh, current uh, players to count towards your uh, thousand. That's your first thousand. All the rest afterwards, the eight extra I have and the 181 extra he has is ones that he's bought. You buy them from uh, using God favor points. So here what I want to do is I want to do the show details. And this will show that my attack strength was 16.14% greater than my enemy's defense strength. Okay, that doesn't mean my attack strength is stronger than his attack strength. It means my attack is stronger than his defense. So, uh, if I keep beating on him and he's tired of me beating on him, he can boost his defense a little. And if I don't boost my attack, then I will no longer beat him. Okay, that's one of the things, one of the ways about the game. Here I can look for clues on how to make myself stronger, not just to beat him, but to beat other people because I want to be at maximum strength. Alright, what I do here, the game is split, that your warriors are, uh, your items are split into warriors, chief, uh, chieftains, okay, uh, can take ten warriors uh, into battle, chieftains are like uh, you know, squad leaders, and so each chieftain can lead ten warriors, and uh, so I have a maximum of ten thousand and eighty, okay, ten times one thousand and eight, and this list lists my, uh, see uh, right here it shows that uh, my chieftain uh, part of the battle is weaker because uh, he has more. But look at this, I'm stronger because I have stronger warriors. Now I can increase my uh, warrior troop strength, okay? Because look at here, this is the, hey, it shows I have 8,913 Vitter Berserkers. Those are right now currently the strongest uh, items, warriors that I can buy. But at 720, I can buy the next higher one. So right now, if I wanted to boost my, my warrior strength, I could buy uh, 26 more of these here. It would get rid of it would it would knock these down. So if I bought 26 and 16, which is 30, 42, it would increase this up here, and then I would be at the strongest strength I could there. But I can then increase myself further by crafting some items. Some of these items up here, mist runners. Uh, let's see, ivory elves and a few others are, are uh, crafting items, blacksmithing items. I'm making a video that will go into more detail. I've got an introductory uh, video about it right now. Then down here it shows our weapons. Okay, my weapons are stronger, but look at this. He's got way more. He's got 900, almost 900 more weapons than me, yet I have a stronger weapon uh, cluster than he does, uh, for lack of term, uh, I just made that up right now. Okay, I can increase myself, I can make myself at maximum strength by making sure that I have is uh, many of the most powerful items that I can get. So, the Suter Fire Swords are currently the strongest item I can get. I could increase my weapon uh, arsenal slightly by buying one more of the Fire Swords. If I buy extra, they're not used, but they can be there for a buffer in case you gain a new chieftain. If you get a new chieftain, then you can then have 10 more warriors and 5 more weapons. Each warrior can take 5 weapons into battle, so you have half as many weapons as you do warriors. All right, you can look at this list and you, you can figure out when you up here and you go... Gee, okay, if I had more of these, uh, underworld rings, okay, I would be a lot stronger. So, if I, when you get the higher powered items, it, it stops using the lower powered items. So, if I was to go, say these here, this is a drop item here, the, uh, Tarn Capes, I don't know.